Hello guys, thanks for watching, Adrian here from Epsid. So in this uh, super short video I want to, to explain how to use the um, React Generator uh, which is a free service uh, that can be used even without an account on AppSeed uh, to generate a, a full stack web application on top of Purity Dashboard which is a pixel perfect uh, design from Creative Team. Okay, once we, we are here on the, um, on the generator page we need to select uh, the preferred backend framework. In this case, I will use Django and uh, hit the next and generate button. Uh, at this point, the, uh, the server analyzes our request and uh, if all good and uh, the service uh, is not overloaded, uh, we should be able to, to get the, the product source code, which is provided in, in two flavors. The, the, the first one is this zipper chive, which comes uh, in just a few seconds um, that we can uh, download and use it right away. But uh, the second, uh, the source code is already provided as a GitHub repository and the um, sources basically are uploaded to GitHub in order to be used uh, later on and um, using a versioning system. So uh, for the demonstration, I will I will wait to uh, to get the sources from uh, from GitHub, and once uh, the sources are uploaded, we should have here um, a link, and uh, once we have access, I will uh, download the the sources using JIT command line and build the product. So for newcomers, um, the service is free. Uh, AppSeed basically it's a platform that knows how to generate a simple uh, full stack web application in different patterns um, on top of different designs uh, like um, uh, Argon design, Black Dashboard, uh, Daytable and other things using uh, Django, Node.js, uh, React, Vue and other technologies uh, to, um, to build the products. Uh, another thing is that the, the source code is uh, uploaded uh, on GitHub under the MIT license, which means, uh, which means you can use it in commercial projects or simply for learning activities. So there is no restriction regarding the usability of the, of the product. Okay, so the sources are uploaded to GitHub. So uh, we have here the, um, the code. You can see that uh, this file, for instance, was generated one minute uh, two minutes ago, and uh, the README should um, should have all the information that we need in order to start and use the product. Okay, let me clone the sources here. Sorry, git clone. I will drop here the URL. I will use uh, VS Code to open up the source folder. Okay, once we have the sources, we need to um, start the API um, Django server. This can be done using uh, using Docker. basically this command docker composer up minus minus build make sure you are in the api directory and for the react ui i will switch the directory to the react minus ui and uh, just uh, call yarn yarn start to compile the sources and uh, uh, start the application the Django API should uh, should be uh, compiled sooner because the application is uh, the backend logic is super super simple. It's uh, just um, implements that JWT authentication using uh, web tokens, and uh, there is no other other feature. And uh, the React UI is already configured to to use the the backend and. Uh, in less than one or two minutes, we should be able to use the product without any effort. The purity design is provided by Creative Team on top of Chakra, which is a, a quite a popular uh, React UI framework. 
and uh, using Chakra we can build uh, super interactive and uh, nice user interfaces but in this case the application comes already with uh, many components uh, and, um, and pages and uh, we just just use the products as it is and uh, like this we um, we speed up um, our work and um, we, we need to cut less in order to, to get the, the job done in case anyone have issues with uh, with the product feel free to uh, to access here AppSid go to the go to the home page and uh, go to the support page uh, we have here the credentials this is the official email and also you can uh, use Discord and uh, chat with the support team one to one in case anyone have issues or simply uh, just wants to to join the community the react ui is still compiling but uh, soon should be should be available in the browser by default the application is not shipped with any default user so uh, the private pages um, in order to access the private pages we need to um, uh, create a new user and uh, later authenticate and once we are authenticated by the application we are able to we should be able to access the, the private pages let me use um, incognito uh, mode in the browser just to have a, a clean session Okay, so uh, as I mentioned before, by default, the uh, guest users are redirected to, to the sign-in page and uh, in order to bypass the authentication, you need to sign up first. Let's uh, use a simple, simple password and standard credentials. Once the user is successfully authenticated and created into, into the uh, Django API server, we are redirected to the sign-in page and uh, we just simply authenticate. Cool. So this is the, this is the UI. Um, the application comes with this uh, dark mode, which is uh, by default provided in Chakra. There are many pages, RTL support, um, a profile page and uh, other things that uh, might help us in uh, to code with less effort a new an amazing dashboard using react so guys thanks for watching adrian here from AppSeed and um, uh, feel free to to use the product tell us what you think uh, feel free to contact us and uh, suggest more features that should be added to this uh, to this product and also to the generator and uh, in all cases, we will uh, listen and try to help. Thanks again for watching. Adrian here from Vapsid. And as always, I wish you all a super, super day. Bye, guys.